Garrett Temple has been anything but silent when it comes to the ongoing issues with racial injustice in America. He understands that there are bigger issues at hand than winning basketball games, and his leadership has been invaluable both on and off the court. Chris Sheeran has more. Garrett Temple wants to be heard. The National Basketball Players Association member and hopeful lawyer knows the importance of using your voice. With the recent events surrounding the Black Lives Matter movement, he feels that some people are finally listening. I think this situation is a little different. Unfortunately, not in the fact that another black man um, has been killed, uh, you know, subsequent to uh, another black man in Atlanta and then a black woman. Um, but the fact that the um, how people have reacted to it, um, specifically how white America has reacted to it. It seems like people are finally starting to care about, uh, you know, unarmed black men uh, being brutalized by the police and just black uh, black Americans in general uh, being marginalized. So the biggest the biggest thing I, I see is the is the difference in how it has you know affected or how uh, everybody or how everybody else is trying to help and uh, you know is realizing what the devastation that's going on. In my opinion, because of how I was raised and how I do things, and, uh, and more so now, you know, I think the NBA, the, the average NBA player is more socially conscious now than 15, 20 years ago. Um, definitely more so than when I first got in the league. So I can't really speak on 15, 20 years, I wasn't in there, but more than 10 years ago, the, the uh, black NBA player is more socially conscious. And because of that, I would hope that you're not only conscious, but you're active uh, in using your platform and your resources to help things that you feel like should be changed. Um, whether it is putting money into certain situations, having a foundation that help, helps fund certain issues that you wanna uh, see get better. Um, and I think the resources that we have uh, because of the support we're able to play for a lot of money, we can utilize those resources to help the communities that we um, grew up in, live in, uh, care about. The ability to speak up, the ability to have an opinion, the ability to uh, raise conversation with the group is huge, whether that's on the floor or off the floor. And, and Garrett fits in line with that. We talked about uh, being able to communicate with your teammate uh, in positive and negative situations and grow from it. Uh, and so he is uh, the prime example of uh, how we want to carry ourselves on a daily basis. At the end of the day, everybody uh, you know, has their own thoughts on how to affect change. I think the main underlying point is that everybody wants the same thing. Kyrie, um, myself, uh, most of the black men in, our, in the league that are passionate about this, or if they weren't passionate, most of them are passionate about it now. Um, we want the same thing. And, you know, there are a lot of different ways to skin a cat. Um, the conversations were actually those conversations, you know, thinking about ways, which, what way, uh, what is a way that we can most u utilize this, this extra push, this, this, these extra ears, um, and extra eyes that are on this situation. 